G'day guys. So this year my plan is to grow some or breed some goldfish. And last year I tried but it wasn't particularly successful. I put some little spawning mops inside of the fish tank but I have a feeling all the other fish kept on eating the gold, eating the little babies and the eggs before they got anywhere. So I thought with plan B this year. Best. So this is my little goldfish sexy time thingy. So basically what happens is I'm going to put the collected goldfish, so I'm going to watch them and wait for them to start chasing each other. So when they start chasing each other, a couple of males will latch onto a girl and chase her around who pops out the eggs and does it that way. So I'm going to find the ladies that I like that are doing it, whack them inside of here, and then they can go inside of the pond. So what I've got here is a pretty simple little contraption. I've got some pool noodles that I got from Kmart for $3 for two of them. I've got some wool, I think that's $2 dollars worth of wool and it's all spread down so all of the goldfish will lay the eggs into there and some little close baskets from Bunnings which were $3 each. So I'll show you how they go in. Okay so with them all in there I'm going to select some goldfish that I like. So I want to get the best characteristics out of each of them and I don't want to crossbreed the fancy ones with the plumbers and stuff like that. So I've been watching them and some of them have started chasing and I've separated them because I haven't had enough time to do it properly. But now I've got all this set up, I'm going to go catch some goldfish and put them in there with the varieties that I like. And naturally, the first one here is Dickhead. Because how can you not like Dickhead? So he's going to go in there. And I've got this little lady. And this comment in here, she seems to be ready to pop some. Right, so this is one of the boys that I'm going to get to do the jeed. Okay, so as you can see, the goldfish are quite happily inside their little cages, or inside their little sexy time mops. And hopefully they'll, they'll do their thing and pop out some eggs. So once I find eggs inside of the little mops, I'm going to take them out of there and move them into the other bit. And then the fish can grow, the fry can get raised up in this tank here. I've got a spare one here for some goldfish. So when I notice some more fish start chasing each other, they'll go straight into there and then they'll be ready to spawn straight onto the mops. So yeah, that's about it guys. Thanks for watching and I will update it when I get some goldfish.